teachers, business community members, church representatives, healthcare professionals, and persons from community groups participated in the two-day workshop aimed at unraveling the complexities of gender-based violence and discovering strategies to combat the issue. The workshop held in Karikou last week proved to be a beacon of enlightenment. Father Edward Mark, addressing the sensitive topic of family, children caught in invisible chains, coercive control, domestic abuse, and children, evoked a mix of emotions, prompting participants to reflect on the profound impact of gender-based violence on families and children. In some cases, a lot of cases are not officially reported, and so some are swept under the carpet, and those that are reported, um, the relevant authorities and organizations are taking a proactive role to reach out and to provide the necessary um, assistance. And of course, there is a protocol that they follow, and this protocol enables those who would want to report a safe haven, a safe space. Because there's a high level of confidentiality. I think what, what we need to impress upon those who want to come forward, the importance of seeking to break the vicious cycle. He also delved into the dynamics of understanding power and control. Of course, beyond a shadow of a doubt, all of us should be advocates of change to ensuring that we correct such behaviors. Because... What we find happening, if we continue to let it fester, we'll have, we'll, have, we'll have more crimes because persons in the situation, for example, if it's physical violence, someone may get the upper hand, one badly damaged in hospital and the other could be dead. So we can see an upsurge in violence and crime. We can also see the self-esteem of our various communities, our women, men, you know, being lowered and brought to the gutter. As the event unfolded, participants explored the intricate connections between gender equality, social protection, masculinities, and GBV under the stewardship of Senior Program Officer Jacinta Alexis. Program Coordinator of the Grenada Spotlight Initiative, Elaine Henry McQueen, shed light on the nature of gender inequality and GBV. Her insights sparked contemplation and dialogue, fostering an atmosphere of shared understanding. She encouraged the over 30 participants to be advocates, noting the commitment and focus required. The participants, now bound by a shared commitment, to combat gender-based violence left the Casada Bay Resort with a renewed sense of purpose. The workshop not only equipped them with knowledge, but also ignited a collective spark, inspiring collaborative efforts to build a safer and more equitable society. For GBN News, I'm Nisha Paul.